Hey everyone, Mtash here, and I've been trying to figure out why Better Devils feels better than all the other hand cannons in the beta. Granted, there's only two other hand cannons, but of the three hand cannons, Better Devils is a dominant force. I've been looking at the range stats, the stability, I've taken them out in paint to look where the advantage is coming from, and it isn't in the stats of the gun, it's in the perks. And the big perk is Explosive Rounds. Now, Explosive Rounds was pretty decent. It wasn't anything special for the most part in Destiny 1. It didn't do a lot other than sometimes jar your opponent's aim. Things like that. PvP, it wasn't amazing. I don't think it was very good at all. I don't think it brought really anything to the table in PvP. However, in Destiny 2, it seems that Explosive Rounds might be one of the best perks out there. I'm talking, this may be a top tier perk. Granted, we haven't seen everything else, but I want to describe the value that Explosive Rounds brings and why you might want it on pretty much every hand cannon, hell, any gun in the game. So let's get started. If you look at the damage numbers when I'm shooting, you'll notice some little, Oh God! Oh! I <laughs> fell off the map! Alright, let's, let's get back into the guide. Just like in Destiny 1, Explosive Rounds takes a percentage of your damage and shows it as an explosion. In this case, with the Better Devil, it's 23 damage. Now, it doesn't actually change how much damage you do overall. If you still, if you get a crit, you get a crit. Uh, if you're hitting them in the body, you're hitting them in the body. It takes the same amount of kills to kill with this hand cannon over others. If you take one better devils and give it explosive rounds and another better devils, uh, it, it, it'll kill in the same bullets. However, there's a nice nifty little trick that I've noticed from watching that makes explosive rounds extremely good on the weapon. There's no damage fall off on the explosions. So what ends up happening is you can duel with someone across the map and still hit him with that 23 damage. This means you have a great up close weapon in the better devils. If you're getting in a duel, you can get a pulse rifle out or a scout rifle out as your other weapon. But, if you run into a situation where you need to switch weapons quick, you need to help out in a fight, and you have your better devils out, it's still an extremely useful tool at a range. I'm talking you can 4 and 5 tap people, which is pretty standard, from an absurd distance. Like that guy all the way at A? Easy. Easily, easily 4 tap that guy. There would be no problem hitting him with a 4 tap, I mean, as long as your aim is good. But the damage, the, the amount of damage that you're dealing will not be an issue, because the only part of damage falloff that's happening is the initial bullet, not the explosion. So, while you might have this same hand cannon without explosive rounds and you're shooting someone at a major range, yeah, it might take six or seven shots, because there is damage falloff in this game. But when you have explosive rounds, you extend the amount of range you have that you're doing, you know, almost full damage, and, uh, and this weapon becomes a long-range murder machine. A long-range Weapon. It's like a it's like a pulse rifle. Look at this. Easy, 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 easy. 23 damage, 23 damage. It's so good! It is so good. I mean, yeah, my aim isn't the best yet. I'm on PC. Don't judge me, okay? Don't don't judge me. But if you guys have the opportunity to find a weapon that has explosive rounds, hoard that shit. Do not delete it, even if it's a blue gun, because you might just have a monster for PvP. Before I go, I'd like to let you guys know that I actually have a design by humans now and I'm selling a few different shirts. Because it's the Labor Day weekend, there's 15% off all the shirts right now. If you're interested in picking one up, the link is in the description. And I'd also like to thank my Patreons because you guys are keeping the channel going. I've seen a few videos here that I've kind of tried to game the system and I've get some ads on, but I still do have a few that are getting demonetized and I don't know why. Patreon is allowing the channel to keep running. And I really appreciate that you guys are helping to fund Keep the Dream Alive. I'll see you guys soon. Bye-bye.